Hi everybody. I got a phone call this morning from my neighbor saying that at a different Lowe's uh, they had a shipment of milkweed come in that was loaded with caterpillars. And I guess this was a couple days ago anyway. I went down and bought some plants. I got this Where is he now? This was the biggest caterpillar I found. <laughs> and the crow told me that, yeah, they had a lot of caterpillars, but a lady came in yesterday and was picking all the caterpillars off to take them home. <laughs> so, anyway, you should see the, um, Plants are really eaten up down there. So I picked out the nicer ones with, um, here's another little guy in here. There he is. And this plant had a couple on them. Can see that guy's chowing down. Mm, there was another one here, and I found a couple other little ones. But the reason I took these also is I want to show you this one had a lot of eggs on it. You can see the eggs, so that means I'll have little caterpillars coming. And so, I bought these three. Um, I need the milkweed anyway because I'm, I'm out. <laughs> I'm going to show you then. I'm going to go around the front of the house and um, all, all my milkweed plants are, are bald from the caterpillars eating them all. So, uh, I want to keep them going. I only have about five left from before, so anyway, uh, I needed to buy more milkweed to keep the life cycle going, so um, I'll be back in a minute. I hope, these, I hope these plants come back here. I'm sure the ones in the pots will. That's no problem. So as you can see, they're all bald, and on here, you'll be able to see those terrible milkweed bugs, and they just get all over the place. Hundreds of them, just like the aphids. There's another pot I have. At least with these bugs, with when I have my gloves on, I can s squish them. They don't really fly away. And the I do the same with the aphids because you're not supposed to use any toxic chemicals on the plants. So I have to wait for all of these to go back. Uh, cut them back and let a miracle grow. This is really sad looking except for the real pretty dragonfly that's on the top here. Pretty blue one. These are my extra small pots I keep going. And I've been putting seeds in here but it takes a while for them to take. Okay, I got the plants down here. I went through them and took the other caterpillars off and put them in a, a cage I have already for ones that are turning and I um, have a plant in there. So I have this screen and uh, I have to keep them outside here so I'm going to keep in the carport so I'm going to wrap the screen around it.
something like that. And then I'm going to put a piece of uh, cheesecloth over top. Keep the bugs from getting in. Okay, and this is what it's going to look like. So now I don't have to worry about any bugs getting in there or any caterpillars getting out. So, thanks for watching everybody. Bye.